How's it going? My name is George Weiner. I'm the Chief Whaler of Whole Whale. We have got an awesome template for you in Google Data Studio. We were looking at MailChimp and we wanted more from their reporting, so our team just spent a ton of time to create a custom mail, I think it's pronounced MailChimp dashboard for you so that you can export and then make sure uh, you're getting uh, some great visuals on that. So our team's gonna walk you through it so you know exactly how to use this free Google Data Studio dashboard and pro tip, they'll tell you how to do it, but you can also set it to email yourself. So, yes. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is make a copy of this file, which you can do up here. And then you're gonna need to connect your data sources. So this is going to be Google Analytics and MailChimp. And we'll link to our article below explaining exactly how to do that. And then once you have your data sources connected, you can customize this template however you like. So this is really just a jumping off point. On the first page, it's just gonna be a big email report performance overview. So this is gonna give you an overview of each individual email campaign you sent, including the send date, the day of week it was sent, the subject line of that email, total recipients, open rate, click rate, unsubscribe rate. So here you can also toggle between your email list if you wanna narrow it down that way. And you can also adjust the date range. Some questions you might wanna ask yourself when looking at this page are, what subject lines get the most opens? Which segment gets the most opens? and which email type gets the most clicks. So really big picture. On the next page, we're gonna be looking at trends and email performance. So here we're calling out broader trends by outlining email performance by MailChimp list, as well as email performance by day of week. So here you'll see your individual list, the total number of recipients, and then their individual open rates, click rates, and unsubscribe rates. Some questions you might wanna ask yourself when looking at this page are which list gets the most opens, which list gets the most clicks, which list sees the highest unsubscribe rate, and what days of week get the most opens, which you can see right down here. On our final page, we're gonna be looking at email performance on your website. So this is going to pull in data from Google Analytics to help you understand how your traffic from email performs to all other types of traffic on your website. So here you'll see that comparison, looking at all users compared to email only, specifically for sessions, pages per session, bounce rate, and goal conversion rate. You'll also be able to see top landing pages here, you can see the default channel groupings and see how email stacks up compared to the other channels. Finally, you'll also be able to see sessions from email over time here in this chart. So some questions you might wanna ask yourself when looking at this page is, what is the monthly rate of email signups? Which landing pages capture the most email signups? And which traffic sources drive the most email signups? So those are some great questions to ask yourself and to get yourself started with our template. Hey, thanks so much for joining us today uh, to talk about dashboards, which we love, and Data Studio. If you have questions, you can leave them in the comments below. We look at those things or tweet us at Whole Whale. Look, if you liked what you saw also, uh, and you want to get a little deeper with Whole Whale, you know, visit wholewhale.com. Yep, wholewhale.com, that's where you find us.